In the morning? Yeah, let's get rolling. Time to have some fun. Besides, haven't you ever heard that early bird gets the worm? That early bird thing isn't all it's cracked up to be. You ever taste a worm? I'll take a stack of waffles any day of the week over a worm. Ah, uh, waffles? Never mind, Foxy. I'm out of bed now, so we might as well start having some fun. What do you want to do first? Freeze tag? Dodgeball? Perhaps a little game of hoops? I got something better in mind. On my way over here, I found this great place to play. Follow me! What are you doing? Taking you to my top secret play spot. No. What are you doing right now? Uh, crossing the bridge? You can't do that. Uh, what do you mean? I mean, what happens if you get halfway across the bridge and a train comes from the other side? I hadn't thought about that. Well, think about it for a second. Ouch. Ouch is right. All right, we'll just go around. Come on, my secret play spot is just on the other side of this tunnel. Come on, Birdie, come on. Uh, uh Fox, I wait, I don't come think. Come on, Birdie, you're not scared of the dark, are you? No, Fox, I'm not scared of the dark. I am, however, scared of what could be in that tunnel. Like what? Bears? Are you scared of bears? I'm not scared of bears, Fox. I'm scared of trains. That's a train tunnel, and it's dangerous for you to walk or play in there. If a train suddenly entered the tunnel, you would have nowhere to go, and there's no way you can outrun a train. Ouch, again! Come on, we'll go over this hill. <laughs> you know, Fox, I really don't think this is a great place to play. What are you talking about? This place is the greatest. Look, Birdie, I'm a tightrope walker. At least a tightrope walker has a neck to protect them. Why would I need protection? If I fall, I'm only a few inches from the ground. You don't need protection from falling, but you might need it for the train that could hit you. What? You should never walk, play, or sit on the tracks. Trains are so fast. Even if you hear one coming, you may not be able to get off the tracks in time. You could get stuck or trip, and before you know it, the train is right on top of you. Now, why don't we go down in the pond instead and... Oh, Fox! Awesome! Fox, wait! Look, Birdie, we can play hide-and-go-seek in here. I'm telling you, Foxy, this is a bad place to play. If that train were to move suddenly, you could fall down and get caught in the wheels. I won't fall, Birdie. I'm a great climber. Accidents happen, Foxy. Even the best climbers can fall. Plus, the train could start moving, taking you with it. You could end up a long way from home. Yikes! I could end up all the way on Mars. Probably not all the way to Mars. You know, jumping from a moving train is extremely dangerous. So once that train starts moving, you're stuck until it stops. All right, Birdie. You win. Maybe we should just leave. I think that may be best. Let's head for the pond. Wow! Oh, yeah! Lucky Penny! Oh, 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 hey, Birdie, I know just what to do with it. Uh-oh, this can't be good. Oh, yeah, Birdie, my grandpa told me that it's good luck to put a penny on the tracks. It gets all squished up like a pancake when it gets run over. The only luck this penny will bring you on the tracks is bad luck. If a train runs over it, there's a good chance it will shoot right back at you like a rocket. <laughs> oh, Grandpa never told me about that part. It's not just the penny fox. A rock, a spike, or even a pop can could fly at you if they get on the track. In that case, I better get rid of the penny. I wouldn't do that if I were you. 
Let me guess. Bad idea. That penny, or a rock, or anything else you throw at a train could just bounce right back and hit you. Okay, okay, I get it. Let's get out of here. Wait up, Fox. What now? We can't just leave the train yard by walking away. Whenever you are around tracks, the most important thing to do is stop, look, and most important of all, listen. Stop, look, and listen. I can do that. Stop, look, and listen. You know, Fox, the best way to be safe around trains is to just stay off, stay away, and stay alive. <laughs> Wanna be safe around big trains? All you gotta do is use your brains. Uh, yeah. So stomp your feet, jump and jive, stay off, stay away, and you'll stay alive. Stay off! Them to stop quickly. Even if the engineer does see you, it could take a long distance for them to completely stop. That's why it's so important to look for trains every time you see a crossing signal. Crossing signal? Yeah, like this one here. When a train is close, it will light up and warn you. Ooh. When a train is coming, don't try and run in front of it. Instead, stand back and watch it go by. If you are in a car and the car stops on the tracks, Get out right away and get clear of the tracks while you wait for help. The train yard seemed like it'd be a lot of fun. Too bad we can't play there. Is there any safe way that I can play around trains? Well, actually, there is one way to play safely around trains. 